And we are back with some more surviving Mars over here. Now, in the um, last episode, um, we have a cold wave coming in one soul, which is actually quite okay with us since we have the subsurface heater researched and already built as uh, as well. So that should not be a problem. We have a meteor storm coming in as well. So as long as it doesn't land directly on us, we should be should be fine. Now, what will be a problem, however, is that we have no money and we are, well, I really want to do this um, um, planetary mission over here. We have the metals, we have the fuel, but we're missing 19 electronics. Um, normally it would be fine, however, we don't have the money for it. We can't get any from the uh, underground rare metals over here. And we don't really have any other <clears throat> missions over here that would grant us money. Uh, also, if I go to the research tab over here, um, we don't really have the tech just yet, so we could get some more money. Um, yeah, so... We do need that money, but I did want to go down the physics and focus on that. Um, and same with the breakthroughs. There's a couple more over here that I really wanted wanted to have. Now, option one, to get money, we could research nine break, breakthrough technologies. We've done two, we need another seven. We go back into research view, we only have another four that we can research over here so it bring the it would bring the total to six which means we need another three and those other three would probably cost quite a bit in research as well we could do that and hope um, we'll get some more breakthroughs um where were we here so that would give us three billion and that would be amazing. Uh, however, then we would re rely on the hopes that we will get those three more. The other option that we have is to go down the social tab here. And I think there is a repeatable research somewhere in the beginning here. The only thing is I don't know how far down we have to go. So that is option number two. Option number three, obviously, is not to get the electronics, which I don't really take as an option, to be honest, since we, we desperately need... That 400 extra per soul is huge for us. Well, would be huge for us if you get it. Um, option number four is to complete this planetary survey over here. And, <clears throat> sorry, we might get a mission that grants us money. Um, typically, with those missions that grant you money, they require resources. It would be fine if it required metals and concrete only, but quite often it requires about, well, I think at least 30 or 50. One of those three, either polymers, machine parts, or electronics. If it's polymers or electronics, we could do it. If it's machine parts, we wouldn't be able to do it. So what I'm thinking is, I think we'll have to go with the with the social tab and hope that it's going to be one of those ones. Yeah, let's do that. Let's get into this episode. We'll unpost the game. And uh, I mean, we can always hope that we'll get some more uh, research anomalies over here as well. 
Let's scan these ones too. Oh, that was the last one. Yeah, so that's what we can do. Um, if we Sector get... Sector scanned. Anomaly found. This is... Perfect. Alright, so we can... <laughs> wow. Yeah. Let's, um... Well, let's go down here. We'll scan these two. Now... Oh, wrong button there. Now, normally I like to... Keep those anomalies. However, in this case, I feel it's a bit of an emergency. Oh, not really an emergency. But just to um, boost our research capabilities. Yeah, that 400 research per soul would be massive. So yeah, I think it is, we can classify it as a as an emergency. Oh, there's some... wait. So the meteor storm is coming down here. Okay, he's already through. Right, so he... yeah, he should be fine over there. Although, as I say this, the meteors have started coming down here as well. <sighs> okay. It seems most of them are coming down here. I really hope if they go up that they don't go up all this way. Yeah, I think we'll have to keep a close eye on them in this area over here, but also on the meteor storm. Because if it does come down up there, we're going to have to move a few things around. Let's see, this is almost done. Anomaly analyzed. Thousand. Well, a thousand will do. It would have been nice to get a little bit extra. But oh well. I will take it. That means we're 81% there. Which that most likely means we, with the next one, we'll, we'll definitely get the social. And we may also get the planetary survey. Oh yeah, we did have another option to get more research as well, but that would have involved money, which we don't have. We could have outsourced it. But yeah, it's, it's uh, at least 200 million. We only have 59. So yeah, kind of, kind of limited options there. But hey, then again, it is 1,045% difficulty, so... Not expecting things to be easy and handed to us. Now we'll get this one done as well. Almost complete. Now getting back, however. Research uh, complete. Anomaly let's analyzed. Watch this for a second. Ah, uh, increases. Wait. Increases research provided by sponsor by hundred. Actually, this is not bad at all. Give us another hundred. That's actually very good. Now, one, two, three, four, five. So that's the first tier. One, two, three, four, five. The second tier here. I think it was like that. So I'm thinking the repeatable income one should be in the next tier. I hope it's on the, the first one that we uncover. And I hope it's not the last one. I mean, six or seven. And position over here would be absolutely fine. <clears throat> Preferring the sixth one though. If it was the last one, then yeah, that would slow us down a little bit. Okay, let's try and actually. This is almost 84% done. Um what we'll do, I think. This is taking only five. We're still in, in the positive over here. Uh, let's get rid of that one. Yeah, I think here we're okay. Now zoom out. There we go. So we can pause. I don't think we need to take him back. The meteor storm seems to be going east. 
so I think we will keep an eye on not him this guy over here and we'll keep him here for two reasons we are about to scan this area over here and we could find some more anomalies and the reason number two don't really want to try back right now 16 hours left so yeah. sector scanned anomaly New found anomaly. nice is that a breakthrough no that's technologies right so if that would give us some more social once that would be amazing let's see how it goes Right, so the meteors are getting a little bit closer. But I'm not worried since it's uh, only here for another 11 hours now. Almost done on this anomaly here as well. Now I know the rocket is ready. But I do not want to send him out yet. I think. Anomaly analyzed. There's more to the barren environs of the red planet than meets the eye. Only reveal two. A veritable treasure trove of undis. 3D machining and low G engineering. So with this one, we're getting the new tome, which is useless for us. At least right now, 3D machining. Although it's great to start producing and machine parts, we do not have the colonists. So again, that is unfortunately very useless for us. At least at this point of time. So, with the dust, uh, not dust storm, the media storm almost over. Mm. I'm thinking there could be more anomalies here. Well, essentially, what I'm thinking is, do I bring back the uh, the rover to this? relatively safe area over there where I can keep an eye on him or do we leave it down here so once the scanning is done we can scan the anomaly right away and we've got some dust devils there as well right okay What is he doing? He's still taking resources. That's good. He's still busy working over there. Right, so those cold waves are pretty long, actually. I forgot to check how many souls was he at the start, but it, so like five or six. New special project. A. We could totally do this. Because 25 electronics. Is about 550,000. Wait, let's pause this for a second. Let's have a look. <clears throat> uh, yeah. We are so gonna do it. Four souls, though. A long time. Four there. But we don't... We need the money. That means... This gives us enough money for three supply pods. Which means 75 electronics. We have 80 right now. That means we can do the other one right off the bat. Okay, cool. Let's do this. Send. Go. Go now. That is such a good timing. And we didn't even need to research this in here. Yeah. Probably want more of these as well. So, yeah, there's so many technologies I want to research, but okay, let's leave it at this for the time being. <clears throat> and let's see, 63% done scanning. He's still going. Good. Let's get rid of that one there. Yeah, I wish this rocket was a little faster. Four souls is quite a bit of time, so that means um, we are on soul 37. Now, the prices, the inf 
inflation increases is it any every 10 or 20 souls if it's 10 that means the prices are gonna increase before we complete the mission oh wait there's more meters okay that must be a random one i've still got a rover here so that's why i'm Trying to keep an eye out for that and ready to pause the game and move him out of the way in case um, one of those meteor rides. No meteors lands on him. And I see 93% scan. Um, yeah. He still hasn't left. Oh, it's still loading. I thought it was fully loaded already. Wait. Sector scanned. Did they unload the fuel? Just to load it up again? Oh, that's a bummer. And we've got some twisters there as well. Sector scan, nothing in here. Well, besides the metals. <clears throat> so that's no use for us right now. Okay, trying to keep an eye on two things. Uh, one more rover here. And those twisters. Right, pause for a second. He's already done. It's not broken. Uh, let's go up again. Do we have any more resources here? No, yes, yes, yes. So. Oh, okay. Uh, let's do that. First scatter up all these. And then this one. Then I want you to get those ones. And then I would like you to come back. Okay. Eighteen percent nineteen. Let's see, rocket is still here. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure what happened here. I'm pretty sure the rocket was loaded with sixty fuel. So I would have assumed that they automatically, you know, just unloaded. 10 of them and just load up on the metals and electronics but yeah I'm not really sure what happened there maybe it is a, some sort of I don't know once you um, select the mission it automatically just empties the cargo and and yeah then you have to reload it Although I'm pretty sure that's not the case. They'd still have to... The drones would still have to manually uh, unload the things. Because uh, I remember from my other playthrough from a few days ago. I had some rockets with uh, the um, rare metals um, loading set to automatic. So each time the rocket got back, the drones would automatically uh, load the metals in. And if I wanted to send it on a mission, they had to unload them first. But maybe, maybe that's not the case, and because uh, it's a uh, hard difficulty, maybe maybe it just resets it. Right, so fifty percent over here. Rocket is loaded with electronics, almost full with fuel. So we just need the metals, which fortunately are right next to the rocket. So. <clears throat> so I will have to wait a little bit more over here. Now Sol 38, let's see. Once it gets to Sol 40 or 41, we will check if the prices have increased as well. And once we send the rocket out, I'm going to bring the uh, Explorer rover back wait did he leave now yeah i think he left now so fantastic <clears throat> right so once this is scanned i'll just wait to see that there's no no anomalies here if there's none i'll bring it back and then we'll start planning out our dome layout because um it seems it's a pretty good location with four vistas relatively close to each other especially the three of them. The fourth one's a little further away. We also have two science 
spots over here. Like, ideally, if we could get a dome right in the middle that covers all those four, that would be amazing. If not, I'm pretty sure we can still put down a dome that cover covers at least. Sector scan. Um, so right there was none. Cool. So let's bring him back, and let's continue the dome discussion slash planning over here. <clears throat> so at least we should be able to get a dome in here that covers two. Yes, it does. If it's right in the middle, we would cover even three. Uh, this one here could cover another two of those. This one can take two. So if we plan it out smart. And yeah, this is a little further away, but this again, if it's somewhere here or here. Yeah. Anyways, we'll uh, leave it for another time being. Um, before we plan this area out, it's not a top priority. Where is our... Uh, let's not ride straight into this. And maybe very slowly come through here. I'm very glad I did double check though. <coughs> Although, even if he rode into this, <clears throat> it wouldn't be a major disaster because we could just bring the drone commander over and repair him straight away. Alright, so he's back. Let's unload everything. We'll put that stuff there. Where are they going? They're going this way. So it seems like in the first 39 souls that we've been on this planet that those dust devils seem to be... really seem to like this area over here. And around us, actually. Right to the left of us. And that meteors... typically come down around this area here. Interesting. So, yeah, we'll, we'll see how that goes. I don't know how random... The um, those look um, disaster spawn locations are, uh, but it definitely seems like, at least so far, they are not that random at all. Maybe a little bit. Or maybe they have a. Yeah, I'm not sure. Anyways, it's soul forty, so let's check. Yeah, the prices have. See electronics 120 now, it was 110 before, so that's an extra 10 million. Um yeah. Well on a more positive note, with the Earth Mars initiative. Oh wait a second. Oof, okay, I was afraid they might come here. Um, yeah, with the research we're doing right now, we are going to get an extra 100 research per soul. So right now we're at 200, so that will bring us to 300 with the mission, the planetary mission over there. That would give us an extra 400 per soul, bringing the total research to 700. Sector scanned. Thank you. And that's a huge jump. From 200 up to 700. And that would speed up our research efforts. Uh, well, over three times actually. Yeah, so I'm looking forward to getting those upgrades through. And once we get them in. Um, I'll see if I... Do I really have to go down the rest of this? If I want money, yes. Alternatively... Mm, no, I think it would be smarter to focus on the money first, because that means 
once we get the money we could bring in more resources resources that are going to be cheaper to order before the price goes even even higher now another thing i don't know for a fact is whether oh, there's another dust those twisters over here not a three oh they just disappeared it seems like new ones have come up uh, what was it saying i forgot I think it was something about the technology. Oh yeah, money and resources. Yeah, with the resources, well, um, whether there is... Um, uh, one second. Come over here. You as well. Um, with the inflation, whether there is an upper cap or, or not. Um, I hope there is. Because if there isn't, then that means some point we are gonna be unable to pretty much order anything from from earth again and that would suck so yeah cold wave is almost over as well which means we do not need this subsurface heater anymore although if I wanted I could leave it on because we don't really need the extra power but since it's um, using up some of our water, well, 50% of our production to be to be exact, then we will just turn it off. Uh, I was gonna say so that uh, this bad boy over here could load up, but it's already almost at the max capacity, so it doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Anyway, since the cold wave is over, um, we can just just leave it. For the time being, hopefully we're not gonna get another one straight away. Although even if it did, if it did happen, uh, that's alright because we are fully prepared. Now, fuel-wise, to be able to go on the next mission once we, once we get the money, I think it's not this one. Where is the mission? Uh, none of these. Nope. Wait. It's here. Oh, it's hiding up there. So we're gonna need 100 fuel. And again, it's gonna take four souls. And right now we have 57. Okay, well. We should be fairly close. And with the loading time as well. We should have enough fuel by the time. And the the rest of the resources get loaded onto the onto the rocket itself. Yeah, so that that should be um, that should all work out just fine. Concrete wise, we have seven hundred already. Sector scanned. Thank you. Almost almost eight hundred extracted. Um, we have a few depots, but it doesn't hurt to put a couple more. And yeah, I don't think we're gonna have to tap into it. this um, concrete patch over there anytime soon. Should be completely fine with this one here. And now 84% on the rocket, so 15 hours left. And with the research, we're 62% there. So yeah, we'll definitely get this one first. Then we'll get the money with all of the electronics. And then once the supply pods have arrived, and we will send the rocket out pretty much straight away. Now, how many supply pods do we have? Three. Three left. Two of them are going to be to bring in 50 electronics. That means it brings us down, well, it leaves us with one electronics left. Since we're not consuming any of them. That will be fine, so that means oh, there's another twist over there. And that means we should be perfectly fine to save the last supply pod. In case one of the interesting planetary missions comes comes up. 
And I'm hoping with the money that comes through. No, yeah. We should have enough money. Because we only need to order two supply pots. And that's going to cost us... Five, six hundred each. Yeah, we should have money and we're going to have some in the bank after that as well. Um, right, so those sectors are... Almost scanned here. I'm thinking what it's worth probably not worth doing this one. Right, so this one's done. Let's just queue up these ones real quick. Cool. So with this being done, we should have had an extra. Oh no, that was the money. Oh, okay. So with the money in the bank. We will order two of those, so that costs us 600,000. Expensive. Let's do one more. Here we go. So that's these resources coming in now. And there's another. No, it's not coming here anymore. So that should be all good. The rocket's almost back, and now with the with the landing of the of the rocket over here it is a good time to call the call an end to this uh, episode so thank you very much for for joining in this one hope you enjoyed and in the next one we are gonna launch our mission to bring in even more research um, power essentially so once again thank you for joining and see you in the next one